Today in disease trends, we're looking at hot water. One of the most common problems in the specific area of South Africa, mostly the northern and the eastern part, not the whole country, but a disease that causes on a yearly basis thousands and thousands of losses in calves especially, and then other younger cattle, uh, and in sheep and in goats. So the treatment for hot water is basically worked out long time ago. There's a very effective treatment, but there's one prerequisite. The prerequisite is that we have to identify the disease very early. Uh, most people want to start the treatment at the stage where they see the severe signs of the disease. But at that stage, your success rate is less than 50%. So if you want to treat with a 90 to 100% success rate, you have to identify the disease very early on. And that is a day or two days before the severe signs of disease start. In cattle, sheep and goats, it's very simple. It's about daily observation. And the one thing that you will see in any calf or lamb that is going to get sick with hot water is that they stop drinking milk a day or two before they show the signs of the disease. So the guy that's look after the cattle must be aware of this. This is what you have to check. You have to check the cow or the ewe's udder on a daily basis. And the day that you see the calf is not drinking, that is the day that you have to catch it, take the temperature. If it's above 40, it needs immediate tetracycline injection. So the treatment's been worked out and a lot of farmers say, but I'm not successful. The only reason why you're not successful with treatment is that the treatment is too late. This treatment, if given in time, it's always successful, uh, but it's come down to daily observation. Uh, a lot of farmers want to do 10 other things, uh, other injections. There's only one treatment needed if you give it in time. And then for farmers to uh, work with their veterinarians, uh, we do the disease reporting on a countrywide basis for a specific reason, that veterinarians understand the disease within their area. They do understand the treatments. And if you ever have a problem like this and you don't have a success, do speak to your local veterinarian. But just on the ground of hot water, there's one golden rule. Early treatment is successful treatment. I just want to thank our sponsors for this program, King Price and Design by Logics, that supported the program to bring this disease trends to you as farmers in South Africa. So farmers that want more information can send me a WhatsApp to number 072-377-4423. If you want more information about the treatment of this disease that we're dealing with today.